All right, one week update. Um, so I didn't have this, this little gate that comes with the thing, with the breeder box, and I didn't have it in. And I found two babies stuck to the, the main tank and the wall. <laughs> so I put the little gate in. I think they're too big for it now, but anyway. Um, I wanted to show you, I clean this every day with one of these. I call it a blue blooper. You can call it whatever you want. A uh, little eyedropper. So what I do, because you're like, how do you tell the leftover food from the babies? So you can tell I already cleaned this side and there's tons of food over on this side left to be cleaned. Um, but it is hard to tell some of the food is the same color as the baby. So I, <laughs> the, the snails don't mind, um, don't mind this at all. They don't mind the water movement. It's whatever. So if I can't tell the difference. I take the babies, the snabies to the car wash. So what I do, I don't know, hopefully this stays, doesn't like to focus on this at all. So what I do, I'm not going to look at my camera as I, oh. I stick in my blue blooper and I just pick up a section of whatever I pick up. So I just suck up whatever I suck up. Okay, here we got, see the two snails that fell down? Okay, that was a bad example, but they stayed, they stayed outside the blue blooper. But let's see if I can, sometimes I just pick up whatever I can pick up and I turn it to the side. So you can see there's food and a snail babies in there. So I just tip it upside down and whatever is heaviest, which is the babies will fall to the bottom and I can just put them back in, in one little drop. And usually what's left is food. This one's gonna eat two little drops. Yep, all that's left in there, sorry, I'm looking at the actual thing. All that's left in there now is gross food. So I'm gonna put that in my little, mellow container. So we take the babies to the car wash. I try not to do that. I try to be careful. Let's see if you can see. And kind of suck up around them and I go really slow. And make sure I don't get any. So that's what I try to do. There's none in there. But like I said, sometimes they're a really dense area with a lot of crap and you're not sure if there's snails in there you just grab it up there's one see just tip it don't squeeze and then just do one little drop back in the tank and then you've got all your crap in here and your snail fall back in the tank 